Carter in a deal of a pickle out there. One nothing. Nordonia Knights leading. One out. But meanwhile, you're here to watch Highland Hornet softball. We're down two nothing. The catcher Kennedy Steinbacker swings and misses. She's down on one. Shannon Apple still yet to allow a hit. Ashley on the other side has given up four. One ball, one strike. One base runner today for the Hornets. It was Paige on a six pitch walk. Apple ready the pitch. Alyssa out for crouching position. Get that. Two and one, as you can tell, the sun is out. Try to aim at the sun. Here we go. Two and one. 2-2, two, two. Kennedy, Tadpole wait out there. Wednesday, Tommy Maroon Sports Show, I think. Yeah, Wednesday, there's no game Wednesday. That'll be on WCTV and the High Horn Sports Network. Kennedy with one in a left, and a nice catch there by Becky Gaynor, one out. Matt, or no, Lane Casimore. We'll see what happens. Again, another good pe er, catch by Becky Gaynor. Or Gaynor. Abby Gaynor at second. Becky Gaynor at left. Two Gaynors out there. Here's your first pitch. That's uh, taken for a ball. It is 1-0. Elaine, the senior. We haven't said her name too much this season. Uh, Zapple rolls that one, 2-0. Oh. Well, we always start off with base runners. Hopefully she can get some, take advantage of this two-ball no-strike count. 3-0, Paige on deck. John right there. So is Brad for the Medina Gazette. There they all are. And, of course, Paige as well and the rest of our team. 3-0, and this one is a ball, take your base. Paige Brookmeyer still looking for a first at bat this contest. For she walked earlier today, advanced on to second, talking with the coach out there. We'll see how they'll do this. Well, here's the double play scenario. It's who you're at short, and Gaynor at second, and Novacell there at first for the Minutemen. Not your double player, perhaps. Leverman out there at third. Here we go. It is Paige. Wayne will be out. Looks like we will have ourselves a new runner. I think that is. Nope, it's Wayne. Wayne Casimore at first. Well now, no re-entrance here. Just heard some solid metal out there on the baseball field. And Paige takes the ball. One and So once again, if it's a ground ball to Hoyer or Gaynor, heck, maybe one to perhaps Nova Cell or Leverman. That's not good. Paige wanted to hit a home run there, but nope, one one. I mean, can you blame her? She had a grand slam yesterday, you know. Could have been there yesterday, but we had scheduling conflicts. This is my eighth baseball softball game of the season as it's two balls, one strike. And you definitely don't take it for granted in a season in which we really seemed unsure if we were going to have it. I mean, compare last year where we did. Page hits one high in the air and a left. And who's got that? The center fielder, two away. Ava Ash made the catch. And now it's Emma Hecky to the plate. So, Ava Ash, I thought she was getting caught out there with Gaynor. But no, Ash and Gaynor did well, hey Spence. Only that first two out. Emma Hecky waiting, and the left hander swings and misses. She really ran into that one and then hit it. Kind of a charge right there. Makes it nothing and one. Here we go, the stretch, and here it is. Emma takes that one for a ball. 
No, Vasilsky, I've been noticing she has been doing that anytime there's been contact out there. Perhaps if it, you know, gets past the first baseman, Nova Cell. There it is, and Emma with a nice drag, bunt down the third base side, and it's 1 2. They'll race the bunt attempt out there for the Hornets. One ball and two strikes. I think I heard someone call my name. As here we go, the pitch. Emma fouled that one. Still one ball, two strikes. Just trying to get the scoreboard to say that. Yeah, two nothing, minute man. Boy, oh boy, will we love to get a hit? Come on, Emma, you got this. Here we go. This. One ball, two straight count. It's a fly ball foul. Leverman wouldn't have gotten that. Instead, the third base coach will. Of course, Gainer out there left. Ash at center. No Vasil skit right. There's a school bus right there. No we'll joining back in right there. One, two. Emma takes that one. Two, two. Of course, that's the one positive thing about Emma Hecke, second baseman. She's really good at running in and getting those hits. She is a slap happy hitter. And if the corners aren't ready for it, she could get on base, but instead she'll pop it up and Leverman makes a nice catch. Three innings without a hit. We need to change that. It's two, not the Minutemen.